Hello everybody, welcome to AP Season 9. This season we're actually gonna do something original for once. I know, hold your applause. Oh my God. <laughs> I am stealing Dibs' joke. Dib, dib, dib. What's the okay. Dib, 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 dib. So, uh, we're doing FFA Achievement Hunters. What's Achievement it? Hunters is a game mode in which you collect achievements and you get certain rewards or shitty things uh, based on what you get. So, there is a list, there's a command you can do in game called slash a list and it will give you a list of oh it's not running right now uh it'll give you a list of all of the achievements that you can get for example um there is stuff like first blood first damage i think and it'll give you various effects so and yeah and yeah. there are uh, achievements that can be earned by every player instead yeah. of just one yeah, some of the achievements um are constantly running so you can always get them and some of them are only available to the first player who gets them. So other than that, it's pretty standard rules for AP. We got a 2000 by 2000 map. Um, no zero zero. No zero zero. It's it's moved again. Uh, pretty standard stuff. Optifine zoom is allowed. What else have we got? Nether is on. Tier Nether two is, is on. Off. Yep. Tier two is off. Horses are on, mm -hmm. but healing is disabled. Yep. Uh, golden heads are on. However, you cannot get a golden head by killing a player. There are only two available heads, and that's by achievements. And I yep. heal three hearts. All right, I think that should be it. Now we will go to Dibs, who's going to introduce all the players. All right, so first we got... Uh, and then we got oh. Brick. <laughs> Winther <laughs> returning from last season. Wait, she's played shit. Uh, Fairy. <laughs> Bag, he's back from season six. Davo. Hey. Steve, I mean Riker. Newcomer, Oddballer. Ew. <laughs> Holly. I said no PDA, what is this? Ginger, <laughs> newcomer Engal, we all lost. Uh, newcomer Delarno, uh, where's we the caveman? Who the this fuck is are you? This is sugar. <laughs> we got Dan's. We got C Matt. Fire Fox. Why your skin change every season? And our last newcomer, above average. He bought his way in by rapping. Oh, and we also have Kurt. And Kurt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Spawned by Krenz, of course. Oh, yeah, spawn is by, by Krenz. Dance. Plug in and spawn by. Wait, hold on. Plug in and. What do you want? God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> all, right. all right, and without further ado, that should be it. Hope you all have a good time. Let's start the game. All right, hello everybody. Welcome to AP Season Nine Achievement Hunters. Um. Oh no. Um. Anyway, basically, like they explained in the game out here, there's a command to do now. <laughs> Bag already got the first enchant table. Um. These are the achievements you can get. Those are the one-time achievements. Um. Yeah, I don't know how well they explained it, but basically, there's these. There's these. Uh. One-time achievements that only, well, obviously it's how it sounds, only one player can get it, and then once that player gets it, achievement's gone. And then there's these sort of, like, achievements that anybody can get throughout the match. Um, those would be long shots, um, which can heal you. Um, at the end of episode 4, whoever's at, or at the start, I think? The end or start of episode 4, whoever's at full health gets the Iron Man achievement, and they, uh, Get their max health set to 120%, stuff like that. But uh, yeah, there's a lot of one-time achievements, and I don't think I'm gonna specifically go for any of them. Mostly because a lot of them kind of rely on luck on whether or not you find certain things, like there's first gapple, first diamond, etc. Um, I also think my sensitivity on my mouse might be wrong here, but I'm not sure. <laughs> anyway, I'm really nervous again. Um, this is actually the first time I've done solo commentary since I uh, had my big oral surgery that basically changed the way I talked like if you watched my cynical season six or phobia season six how it sounded in there that was not too long after it and then like a couple of recent record rounds like nuzlocke and stuff that was kind of a while after where I sound mostly normal and yeah this is the first time I've really done any solo commentary 
any lengthy solo commentary since then, so... I don't know. We'll see how it goes. If I sound a little bit different to you, that's because I'm still trying to get used to talking. And because it requires more effort for me to talk still than it normally would, but, uh... I don't know. Hopefully I'll get completely used to it. But anyway, here's all the players. It's actually kind of a small season for AP, but it's still relatively big for an FFA. I think there's 19 people. 18 or 19. I don't remember. Uh, okay, well, Fairy Juice just got a uh, golden head, because that's one of the one-time achievements. The other way to get the... Well, not, not a golden head, you got a player head. The other player head is um, you can get a Tommy SX player head if you make a diamond shovel. So yeah, that's what like a lot of the one-time achievements are, is... Uh, they require you to get one's first time in chance, one's first gavel, first bow, first saddle. Uh, the one I could go for is the first uh, portal, which you get four gold ingots for. I wouldn't have to go through it, and I don't think I would go through it. I am not somebody who would nether in this, honestly. Um, I could go for that just to get the uh, the gold, but if somebody else is planning to go for it and they're making their whole first episode about that, they're probably already just about to get it. I don't know. I'm kind of slacking, to be honest, if I want to get that. But, uh, uh, everyone's still full. Yeah, um, if you take first damage, you actually get a negative achievement as well. You get your health set to 90% permanently, or, or max of 90% permanently, I should say. So, uh, nobody's, uh, purposely doing that for the stats this time around. Oh, man. This reminds me a lot of Cynical Season 5? I think that was the last FFA I played, and I was, like, really nervous during the start of it. And I'm feeling that way right now. I guess because the first day is always so, like, similar, yet important. I I'm having a hard time telling if I'm shaky or if my mouse sensitivity- I think my mouse sensitivity is messed up. There we go. Maybe? I don't even know, man. I <laughs> I'm really, like, off my game today? Off my game? That sounds so freaking cheesy, like, this is a super competitive sport or something, but... I don't know, that's how I feel, man. Anyway, at least I got some feathers at the start, that's cool. Yeah, I'm definitely shaky for, like, no reason whatsoever, so that's not gonna be good. I normally don't get, like... I don't know, I don't normally get nervous at the start of, uh, recorded rounds. It's usually when I get in the fights that it really starts happening, but... Okay, we're gonna get leather here, and then I just need to get reeds, and then we'll have a pretty good, uh, first day here. Hopefully. <laughs> a lot of people win for, like, the really silly first-time achievements that don't really give you anything. Like, that minecart one gives you, like, rails. A lot of them don't give you anything of much use. Besides the nether portal one, which if I find a surface cave here soon, and it has a lava pool in it, I might try to quickly get the iron to get a, uh, quickly craft a portal. But I'm not gonna go in it. I highly doubt I'm going to nether. Just too much can go wrong, man. And plus, uh, people go there and, ooh, Firefox Vulpix took the first damage, so... Oh, man. He actually lost three hearts in one thing as well. Yeah, so he has a permanent max health of nine hearts now. Or at least he should. So that sucks for him. But I'm kind of glad that just happened, because now it can't happen to me. I still don't want to take damage, so I still want to try to go for the Iron Man achievement, because if you get the Iron Man achievement, you get your max health set to 120. I don't know if it actually heals you, like if it'll heal you the equivalent health or not. Like, if it'll heal you two hearts, but... Or if it just sets your max health to that, but... Yeah, I guess I'll find out if... That does happen. Fire took even more damage. <laughs> Poor fire. If I could find wreaths, then that would make me a very happy lad. Let me tell you that right there. Kinda wanna turn in my sounds a little bit more. Hey, Kurt, you're a little late on the, uh, on the draw there, buddy. Anything? Anything at all? Any good stuff? I would like to find reeds. I definitely don't want to go down without them. Because basically my plan for this is I want to cave until I've got very good gear. And I mean, even more so than Cynical Season 5. Because that was kind of my plan for Cynical Season 5. But I mean, I didn't... I went hunting when really I could have caved longer. But uh, I also did have pretty good gear though. I had power for 200 health because of the game mode. And, like, six gapples or something like that, so, I mean, to be fair, I did have pretty good stuff, but... I could have gotten better stuff, and I died because I didn't get better stuff, probably. Uh, I'm definitely gonna get at least Sharp 3 and Power 3. And I'm basically gonna not leave my cave until I've explored all I can of it. Essentially. Not get too antsy about going hunting early. I, I do want to get out hunting at a reasonable time, but at the same time... 
I want to make sure I can get as geared up as possible from my cave. And if my cave isn't very good, then go look for another one until I'm geared up. Man, I gotta tell you, I know I've said this several times, but I'm really nervous right now. I don't know why I'm so nervous. Uh, golden heads are off besides the two that you can get from achievements, which Fairy already got one of the heads. So apples are something you definitely want to get, and I'm going to see if whoever was here, I can steal their apples. But it seems none have dropped yet, so I might just leave. Oh, I need to get, I might as well take their wood. I need a little bit of wood anyway. And their saplings. GG. If they wanted to replant this forest ever, it looks like it's never going to happen. I mean, I haven't even... You'd think I'd see the other person. But I guess they just chopped and completely left the area without waiting for apples? I don't really know. There might have been a cave around here. I hope they didn't go over here, because I was about to go over here. But yeah, I wonder where they are. I just had a thought that I really hope my mic's recording, but I can't even check right now. So, uh, yeah. I mean, what I just said is really irrelevant, because if it's not recording, then you're not going to hear it. If it is, then, well, hey, it's recording. Kind of like saying, man, I really hope I'm recording. Uh... Okay, I may not actually care too much about the Iron Man thing. If I'm able to rush into a cave pretty quickly here and, you know, take it maybe a heart or two, but, you know, get sufficient supplies from the cave, it'll be worth it. Ha! Ah, I only took half a heart, dang it. <laughs> Still. Ah, uh, gosh, I'm very scared of many people in this game. That's a large reason why I want to get the best gear I possibly can before I go hunting. I mean, you should really always want to do that, and I always kind of do, but I tend to not have the willpower to do so, at least in recorded rounds, I definitely do. I definitely tend to get pretty antsy, I guess, but hopefully I can pull something off this round. Who knows, I haven't won an FFA before. I haven't even really done that great in FFA before. I did okay in Entropy Season 2, but that was kind of a derpy season, because the, uh, the script ended up killing a few people on accident, and it was just overall really weird, so I don't know. I did get probably my best recorded round kill in that, though. <laughs> I killed Chippy, who had power 4, and he was enchanted when I was unenchanted. That was pretty good. But it was also an EU server, which I was using WT fast, and I don't think he was, so <laughs> I had better connection than him. Dang it, Fairy got that thing. I was just about to say that I've got quite a bit of iron now, so I could like try to go for that if I want. It's not that- I don't know why people are that surprised. It's not that hard to actually get that achievement this early. If you spawn near a lava pool and you're able to get into a surface cave. I believe it's been like almost 10 minutes already. Yeah, I've seen way faster than that, but dang it. I was actually hoping that maybe nobody would actually like try to go for that and I'd be able to get it like a little bit late, like near the end of the episode or whatever. But yeah, fairy, I should have expected to definitely take that. A lot of people taking damage. It's kind of cool how those are the Iron Man achievements, so whenever uh, um, someone takes damage, it just announces it in chat, so I don't even have a hit tab. Uh, I cook up iron here and just get full iron for the end of the first episode, because that's always a nice thing to have. It's always something you should aim to have, really. Now, if I could uh, split it correctly, that'd be great, because my Thor, my, my Thor is drying out, everybody. My, uh, my throat is drying out, and I would like to take a drink, but you see, I want to be efficient and do that while this cooks. That way. Efficiency. And bam. You're not gonna notice any difference, but I just took like a five second drink. Wait, this is a used map. We must restart. No. Oh. <laughs> I always get scared when like somebody who's like an operator on the server, or like whoever the host is of the game, says something like that, like wait during the game. I was afraid we're gonna have to restart or something. It's happened twice. That's like season two and cynical season two. Both had to have restarts after playing like 10 minutes into the game. Didn't it winter? Oh no, it's sugar. I thought winter did. Didn't I say? I think I said winter did as well. Well, if I did, then I predicted the future. Whoa, fires at one heart. What? Aww. That sucks, man. How is he taking so much damage? <laughs> oh, well, it was worth it. He got the first redstone block. <laughs> That gives you one diamond, I believe. That was actually another pretty good achievement that I thought maybe I could go for, but... Alright, he got the diamond. Alright. He got the other head as well. Pretty much all the good one-time achievements are taken now. Besides, like, the first bow, which gives you some arrows and stuff like that. Oh, wait, no, the first gapple isn't taken yet. If you make the first gapple, you get another gapple. That's pretty cool, I guess. I don't know. 
I doubt I'm gonna get that one, though. I'd have to be already in a kind of a low-down cave, probably. And I don't even have any apples on me, anyway. Oh, gosh. I feel like I'm gonna have to drink a lot during this, because my throat is especially dry. It's always... I don't know, if you watched my commentary before, then you probably know that I have to drink fairly often, but, uh... It is especially today, because I'm slightly sick. Ugh. Oh, gosh, I just had a thing where, like... Just had a thing where I, like, choked on air and died. That was not pleasant at all. I may have to definitely slow down my commentary a little bit, too, like, for what it normally is, or normally was before the oral sur- oral? Oral surgery. Because, like I said, talking requires significantly more effort. It's not helping that my throat keeps doing this thing where I'll be in the middle of a sentence and then it, like, just dies. Oh, no. Okay, I hear water this way. Oh, the average lost Iron Man achievement. Okay, the water isn't even, like, right here. I don't think there's gonna be much of an actual cave here. I was kind of hoping, man, but I don't foresee it happening. Realistically. Dang it! I was just- I was seriously just going to say I should go up and try to get the first bow right now, but... Nope. Is that a spider actually right? No, it's a squid. Um... Fairy has gotten many achievements. I can tell you that. Well, you could also tell me that. If you weren't blind and deaf. Because you would have seen the same stuff I've seen. Obviously. Ever spider. Yes, I understand, fairy. I understand what it is you're trying to convey to me. Deep down on a personal level. We all have a little bit of ever spider inside of us. Don't you think? Sorry, I, I'm sorry if that got too deep for you guys. I'm normally a pretty, uh, pretty light-hearted channel, but man, that was very philosophical. I'm sorry. Are you taking damage besides? Like, anybody taking more damage has already taken damage. I don't think so. Fire might die in episode one. Or fire. He's on fire. Oh. Kill me. Please, kill me. Oh, God. I'm in eternal pain and agony. Yeah, I hear a bat over there. I don't know. I don't remember if there was more to this cave when I first entered. I don't- wait, over here. Wait, wait, wait. That's not gonna go anywhere, is it? This is definitely not gonna go anywhere, but I'm gonna check it out anyway. Against my better judgment. Wait. Wait. No, okay, of course. I might as well grab the iron so I can get an anvil later. When I totally get an enchantment table, because, let's be honest, I've never gotten unlucky, ever. Ever. I mean, if you watch my recorded rounds, you know I'm the luckiest person alive when it comes to, you know, every every recorded round of UHC. AP, lucky. Cynical, lucky. Phobia, lucky. I mean, it's a pretty well-known fact. Dude, I can, like, already get an anvil. That's actually really nice, because I always hate when I get, like, enchants and I have to spend, like, six years getting iron. I guess it's a semi-productive first episode so far. At least I got full iron, got, you know, stuff I'm I'm gonna need to make enchants, and I got the iron for an anvil already, so I mean, not bad, but I would have liked to be in, like, an actual cave by now, but you can't have all the, uh, all the good things. Maybe I'll be able to get a boat before the end of the first episode, actually. If there's, like, gonna be even mobs on the surface, because it tends to be that there isn't a lot of the time. I should try to kill this enderman. 1.8 endermen are stupid. I say that now, and it's probably gonna hit me. I don't think anyone's gotten the first Ender Pearl achievement. Come on. Ooh, there we go, I got one. Haha. <laughs> now I have three. Because uh, that achievement, once you get your first Ender Pearl, you get two more. Haha, <laughs> fairy. Sweet, I love Ender Pearls, man. I think Pearl damage is off. I believe, I hope, otherwise, those are gonna be kind of. Not completely useless, but nowhere near as good as they would be. Uh, feature? Feature list. I hope I get killed by a creeper while I'm doing this. Uh, and yeah, and pearl damage is off. Alright, cool. Those could come in great handy later, but everybody knows I have them now if they're paying attention. Ah! Uh, what was I up here for again? Oh yeah, spiders. Man, when you play this game, you really lose track of time. See, this is why I'm talking about how I was really nervous those first ten minutes, and now it's just, like, devolved into... <laughs> Really embarrassing stream of consciousness. Um, you uh, maybe get out of my life. Thank you, T.Y. I'm gonna eat more raw food. 
kind of my character trait. That doesn't make sense at all. Ignore me. Um, I was hoping more spiders and stuff would spawn up here. Is that not going to happen? I can always hope I find a mine shaft, I guess. Alright, if I don't find a spider, like, the next minute, at least one spider, I'm going to dodge down. Actually, let's check the root forest. This could be risky, but these tend to have lots of mobs crawling through them. This actually tends to be a pretty good place to, like, guarantee your first bow. Well, actually, let's go into this cave. Nice! Holy crap. So many resources that we just got. I love caving. Anyway, on a not stupid note, let's, uh, check for some spiders. What do you think? What do you think? Uh... You know, uh, you know, yeah, I'm glad there's absolutely no mobs, actually. Yeah, I, at least I did. I, I've honestly had a pretty, pretty good start. Not gonna lie, could be better, but it always could be better, if we're being honest. And it always could be worse. But can't really be much worse than dying, I guess. But and Riker got the first golden apple achievement, which means he got an extra gapple, which means Riker's at full health right now with two golden apples. That does not make me a happy person. And Dibs got the first thing. Oh, I just realized I could have gotten that. Ah, uh, what's your reward for that? Um. I don't know, I don't have it written down. I think it was like books. Dollar and got a saddle. That gives you a horse spawn egg. I think like almost all the first time achievements are gone. Okay, well it looks like I'm not getting a bow on the surface up here, so let's go over here. Neither you look for a surface cave or just vertical mine shaft. Okay, we're gonna have a lot of arrows, which is really good. Because I always seem to get killed by not having arrows. That's one of the main things that kills me. I guess it doesn't usually straight up kill me, but it definitely contributes largely. Um, obviously you can't say, well, if I had arrows, I would have won, because that's a bit, like, not nice. And you can't you can't predict the future, you may still not have won. But yeah, having arrows is obviously a huge benefit, you know, being able to shoot when you want to. Obviously you feel like if you spent the whole time not being able to shoot, then... You would have won if you could, but you don't always know that. And I'm just gonna do a straight diggy down here because, well, you see, it's a free country, and, uh, I limit it, and, uh, gotta do it. Yes, Minecraft is a free country, guys. You heard of here first? Uh, I'm really sorry. Uh, actually, I'm not gonna cook stuff because I'm doing a vertical mine shaft, so that'd be kind of weird. And now, I must wet my throat once more. My voices kill everybody. I'm sorry, and gals' voices also kill apparently. This is gonna be the season where half the people sound either sick, or just weird, or like their voices are dying. Hey, well, we'll see you guys next episode!